Welcome, everybody. Time for Top Talkers. An esteemed panel gathered here today to discuss uh, current events and some interesting topics. Uh, good morning, Connie, Allison, Rick. How are you? Morning. Good, morning. good to have you here. All right, uh, this uh, recent survey <laughs> that says the perfect age gap for partners is four years and four months, but only when the man is the older of the two. Really? Yeah. See, I'm older. You're by older a year. than your uh, hubby? I am by a year. You wouldn't know it. <laughs> I know. Clearly, it's like I'm way older than him because he's so immature. Well, you've but, got three <laughs> children, let's face it. I do, I yeah. do. That's interesting. I find that very you interesting. You find that interesting? Yeah, that the man has to be older than the woman. I yeah. find it works better the other way around. Do you? I do. I'm thinking the study was written by a man. <laughs> maybe. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Or, or a 15 year old because at that point, it's. it's could be interesting if the man is older, then he has more maturity level. But I, I would hope that by the time we hit our 20s, it sort of it sort of levels off. But um, as stuntman Stu proves, that is not always the case. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> Who happens to be Connie's husband? <laughs> so there you get the where we're talking about that. Now, in your relationship, are you older? Uh, my wife is older than I am. Is that right? And my, isn't that interesting? Throughout my family, I have uh, three brothers and a sister, and every one of us, the male is younger. No kidding. Not sure what I wonder that why that is. No idea. Yeah. You've uh, had older, younger. What? Uh, What's going on with you? Tell us about. <laughs> tell us about your relationship. Hey, would you put me on this spot like <laughs> While you're on a chair in, in this uh, environment. Um, I don't have a boyfriend. My imaginary boyfriend, however. <laughs> yes, would be. <laughs> would be a few. I guess he'd be a couple years older than me. And very I'd wealthy, be, I would think. Yes. Uh, well, I'm not a gold digger. He, he would just be very. <laughs> no, handsome. but if he's very wealthy and handsome, that doesn't that's hurt, a bonus. sister. Trust me. <laughs> right. Yeah. If only. Aton. If only I yeah. knew what yeah. I know now. Yeah. I, uh, to be honest with you, I'm uh, I'm the opposite of you. <clears throat> My girlfriend happens to be a little bit younger than me. <laughs> <laughs> and by a little bit, I mean a lot. <laughs> but I think it just depends on the people. I mean, in the in that article, they they reference Chris Martin from Coldplay and Gwyneth Paltrow, right? And he's forty, she's thirty six. But they also got together when they were both in their thirties. So I think that has a lot to do with it. Is when you well, when the couple yeah. gets together. I think you're right about that. Well, I think I think a lot of marriages are really in their twenties. Yes. And I can understand the attraction of a younger woman wanting a bit older man who's a little more established in his career, uh, right? Mm -hmm. You know, eliminating some of the financial pressures that yes. often kick off a marriage. But in the end, uh, they're just numbers, are they not? I think so. I At mean, least I hope so. When I was 21 and living in the Northwest Territories, you know that's going to be a good story, when <laughs> um, I was seeing someone who was 35 and it made absolutely zero difference. Age wasn't the number, it was who he was. I mean, you have a limited gene pool up there in the first place, <laughs> but it, it, it didn't. Limited <laughs> selection? <laughs> that too. Um, <laughs> It didn't make much of a difference. Age is just when you when it comes down to it. I think that age is just well, a number. Yeah. Yeah. But but as a man, I want to put on record, I do not understand the attraction of a younger woman. Honey, I'll be home by five. <laughs> 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 yes, yes, I will, <laughs> and I'll do whatever needs to be done. Um, yeah. I think uh, you know. I I think about my own situation, of course, and uh, as I mentioned, I'm much older than my girlfriend, and I was a little worried about. Were you? Her parents' reaction at the time, not my own reaction. I thought I was a heck of a lucky guy. Yeah. Are you older than her father? Is that the concern? <laughs> no. <laughs> but that very, could be that very could be close in age. Oh, yeah. Really? So, buddy then, so then. But no, no. no. Um, but see, I know yeah, you I was a little it, concerned about that. But you complement each other very well. Yeah, I think you're right. So I think, I think you're it's right. personality. She more likes to think she's the more mature of the two, and well, I'm sure she's right she about is. that. Well, how could she not? <laughs> <laughs> really. But in the end, I mean, we talk about uh, marriages and relationships of all sorts, and, you know, this is a survey, one of those surveys done. In the end, as long as you're happy, yes. is that all uh, we should ask for, you know, in the end? I think that's pretty good. Yeah? Happiness is key to the successful yeah. relationship. And if Ryan Gosling suddenly becomes single, he can always call me. <laughs> you have a long list of those guys. I do, I do. It's a top five <laughs> laminated list. Right. Right. Keto, does, a good marriage. Right. Yeah, does it Stu is. have a list? Doesn't matter. I have a list. Right. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't matter. You're doesn't. right about that. Interesting article, though, and I think uh, you know, you, if you were to look around you and uh, you know, look at a stereotypical uh, marriage or relationship, that would be it. The yeah. man's four to four and a half years of age older. Yeah. No. 
That's very Oddly, true. none of us are I know. in that group. <laughs> Interesting. Says so much. Yes. <laughs> Listen, thanks for your time. Have a great day. Yeah.